Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Plants vs. Zombies. And in the last episode, I showed my first strategy for The Last Stand. And in this episode, I will be showing the next one. I have a little bit of confession to make. Um, I only have, like, two strategies for The Last Stand. <laughs> I thought I had more. I, I I actually did think I had more strategies than just two. But it turns out I just spent like an hour trying to think of what strategies I actually had. And I don't know why, but I couldn't think of any. I just couldn't. <laughs> um, except this is the pretty much the only strategy I could think up of besides the one I have shared previously so sorry about that this is gonna be the only this is gonna be the second and last video of the last stand I'm really really sorry about that I'm just I thought I had thought up of more strategies than just the than just the, the two um, so for this strategy, it's very simple. What I like to do is, let's six, no, crap. I have to restart the level. <laughs> I put it in the wrong place. That's the one bad thing about the last stand. If you put, if you put a plant in the wrong place, then you have to start all over. Yeah, so that sucks. Fortunately, it doesn't take that very long to get back there if you know what you're doing. Like I do. <laughs> sure. Okay. Let's try this again. What I like to do for this strategy is six fume shrooms and make them into gloom shrooms. And they're all they're both on each they're on each side. So six on each side. And the gloom shrooms cost three hundred sun each, including the coffee bean to wake them up. And put two pumpkins right here. I'll show you why in a minute. Put these right here and these right here that's really all you need and then just put spike weed down and then you're good so here we go there's nothing there I'm telling you right now there's absolutely nothing that can get past this except except one plant I mean, except one um, zombie, and that is the jack-in-a-box zombie. If he explodes, you're screwed. That's basically what it is. So if you don't want to lose, get rid of them as soon as possible because he's like more dangerous in, in this level than the football players. And that is why I put the pumpkins there for those guys, because. Um, you you need six of these and you can't have you can't make room for another row to put another um, Garlic behind it. So the best way is to put pumpkins on these two and they'll be protected all the while Well, these guys are shooting them down <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah, nothing really much to talk about here Except that I'm kicking some zombie butt right now. Aw, oh, yeah. And one of the best things about the fume shrooms is that they take out the screen door zombies with, like, no trouble whatsoever. And even the dolphin zombies are not a problem. But I just put those tournaments at the end of the water road just in case. Because when I practiced this level earlier, like, ten minutes ago... <laughs> Um, the, they actually got to the end and started chomping on those tall nuts really good. And I almost lost. If yeah, I would have lost if those tall nuts weren't there, so that's why I have them there. So, first flag completed. 
Now I'm going to put more. Refresh your garlic every every time there's a flag. Refresh your garlic. That is key to this level. If you don't, you could be in some serious trouble. So let's continue. <coughs> man, I'm not feeling well at all. Oh man. There's only gonna be a couple of videos after this. Um. This is what this is while this is going on. I'm gonna tell you guys what I have planned for the last few episodes of this let's play The next episode after this I'll be showing how to get money really easily and The episode the all the episodes after that I'll be showing how to get the rest of the achievements in this in this game uh, Yeah, I'll be showing how to get the rest of the achievements and hopefully I'll be able to because some of them are pretty hard to get but and like I said that one achievement where it's completed an extremely foggy level without disturbing any fog I beat that kind of cheatingly I there was a glitch on my there's there is a glitch in the on the 3ds which caused the which caused the fog to be all obstructed kind of and it like the fog was like kind of like halfway down it was like oh it was like a really like four dash level so yeah, it helped me a lot with that but uh, I'm not really depending on that so it's gonna be pretty hard oh man ah <laughs> uh. So we have the third flag completed here. I mean two, second, <laughs> two, second. So we have the second flag completed here. Fresh your garlic and put another spike weed down on each side. And this, yeah, it does. Um, I'll do that. Does this one too? No, it doesn't. For some reason, usually this one gets chomped on more. I don't know why. I'll refresh that later. Actually, I'll do it now because I don't want them destroying my thing, Bob. Oh, there's a bug on the floor. Go away. Go away, you fiend. Ugh, oh, I hate bugs. I actually. I know that bugs can't hurt me. Like, I'm. Like, if there's, like, a bug in school, and you know how, like, girls are all afraid of bugs, and they scream as loud as they can. Like, there was, like, a cockroach in the class, in our classroom. I just, I just let it walk onto my hand, and I, um, and I let it crawl out the window on, off my hand. And, like, it's not really, um... They're they're not really disgusting. I mean, but whenever somebody asks me to kill a bug, then I I can't do it. I just can't do it. Like I just can't stand seeing like um um insect guts all over the place. I just can't do it. If someone asks me to kill a bug, I can I cannot do it. Like, if someone asked me to even stomp on one and just walk away, I can't do it. I just can't do it. I don't know why, it's just something. If any of you guys have the same, I wouldn't say problem, but same... What happened to that spike weed? Crap, I must have accidentally taken it out with my shovel by accident. Shoot. Oh, well. I can replace it. And that's why you need the tall nuts at the end. They help a lot. Yeah, somehow that got... Must have been the... Accidentally... That... Um... Yeah, replace the garlic again. Um... Replace that. Oh, man. I'm gonna... I'm gonna resist right now putting that spike be there because I might need to replace the garlic inside the level and that like if you don't have enough sun to replace the garlic in the level then you may may be in some trouble 
Oh, the blood just went to my head. Ugh. Ow. <laughs> I actually should be doing homework right now, but I'm too stubborn to do it. And it's Saturday, come on, it's only, what time is it? It's only four o'clock. It's only four o'clock, I'll get it done. And I don't even have that much, I just have one thing. I mean, I could do it just to get out of the way, but... Ooh, diamond, diamond. I was messing around with my stylus. <laughs> I heard a little... Ding -ding! And I was like, ooh. Oh, yeah, um... Um, and... Probably, like, for the last episode of... Of the... Of my... Of this Let's Play, I'll just show the Yeti zombie... Well, actually, you have to, to get one of the achievements, so I can't do that. Yeah, because one of the achievements is fill out the almanac, and you can't do that unless you get the, unless you see the Yeti zombie. So I guess I'll just do that at, like, the beginning of a video or something. Just show that. That works. <laughs> oh, please don't let there be any Jack and Bob zombies. This is the fourth flag right here. Yeah, we're, we're, we're doing pretty good. Oh. See, so yeah, I have enough sun to put that down there. And I have another 250, which I can replace these two with. Um, this one needs replacing, but I won't do it quite yet. I just had to be paying attention. I just, I just need to pay attention to see if it... To see if the um, pumpkins get eaten up by the um, whatever they're called, the the pole vaulting zombies. I can never remember their name. Jeez, man. You can get you can get quite a lot of money from this. Like at the beginning of when I was recording today. Um, I had only 30,000, now I have 34,500. So you can get quite a lot of money from this. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm, uh, feels like I'm dragging, I'm trying to drag this Let's Play on for a while, but believe me, I'm not. I'm just, I want to get on to my next project, which none of you have guessed. I'm getting sad. Because none of you have guessed what my next project is going to be. I'm sad. You guys are mean. You won't guess. Because you guys are mean. Okay, the last flag. Now the, the only... That, that. That is the only thing that can mess me up right now. Okay, they moved on. They moved on. Kill him, kill him. No! Crud. Oh, crud. No, no, come on, recharge. I might be screwed. I'm screwed. No, no! Shoot! Go on to the next row. Yes. Oh, God. Oh, my God. The I'm depending on you to... Okay, these two tall nuts and these two gr gloom shrooms are my last hope. Okay, but I think we got it. Oh my gosh. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how those retarded little buggers, the Jack and Box zombies, can mess up your strategy. <sighs> and that is why I didn't spend that 150 sun on the pumpkin because if I, if I would have done that I would have lost the level yeah so oh man so thank you all for watching this episode of let's play plants for zombies um I'll see you guys next time when we uh, when I will show how to get money easily in this game and so, I'll see you guys next time. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And I hope you guys are having a great day. Goodbye.